Beer is a big part of our Colorado, and for Breckenridge Brewery, the city of Breckenridge is a big part of their story. That's right. For decades, a brewery has been a hot spot for tourists, even Coloradans. But now the brewery is in jeopardy of losing the building that they've operated out of for years. Denver 7 Tom Mustin is looking into why the brewery is now getting an eviction notice. The Breckenridge Brewery has been a fixture here in Breck since 1990, but tonight, along with beer, controversy is also brewing. And we weren't able to talk to the landlord, but we've learned he's filed an eviction notice against the brewery. And tonight, these employees tell me they're not going down without a fight. <laughs> It's one of the most iconic things in Breckenridge. I'm going to miss it so much. It'd be sad to see it go, no doubt. From IPAs to fruited sours, the Breckenridge Brewery has been a popular landmark in Breck for nearly 30 years. Tourists come to Breckenridge. First thing they want to know is where is the ski resort? Second thing, where is Breckenridge Brewery? But now, after three decades, it may be closing time for the iconic brewery. The owner, Breckenridge Brewery Real Estate, no relation, has filed a legal notice to evict the employees. Uh, I'm starting to sweat just thinking about it. Head brewer Jimmy Walker has been at the brewery for 22 years. He says the 70 employees are like family. Most of our employees have been here 10 or more years, uh, three second generation employees. We've been calling this place home for a long time and really want to stay here. But it's complicated. In 2015, Anheuser-Busch in Bev bought the brewery. They say they're committed to keeping Breck Brew in Breckenridge. Original owner Richard Squire is not affiliated with the business, but is one of the owners of the property. Off camera, employees say he has dreams of opening his own restaurant and brewery on the property. Walker says it won't be the same. If we're not here, I, I really feel like this is just going to be another building. It's not going to have that special meaning that it does now. Walker and his fellow employees are taking the owners to court, saying the owners backed out of an agreement to renew their lease. They've also started a social media blitz with the hashtag Keep Breck and Breck. <laughs> Customers are also weighing in. Every single person that I talk to, that I will tell them not to go to whatever is here after they're gone. And as the Breckenridge beer war heads to court, Jimmy Walker says the fight for his family is just beginning. Being here 29 years, going on 30, we want to stay here for another 300 and, and do it within these walls. We're going to stick this out for whatever it takes.